I will now move along to the GST tab. The GST feature is available in Essentials and Plus. When you record your expenses and your invoices, and you specify your appropriate GST tax codes, QuickBooks Online will actually track all your GST tax codes automatically. When you come into the Prepare GST screen, you will see your GST tabulated for you and presented to you in a very clean format which is very similar to what you see in the GST F5 form. If I look at box number 1, I see 64,000. If I feel that this amount doesn't make any sense to me, I can click on View Transactions and this will bring me into a report which will show me the details of all transactions that make up the $64,000 balance. This now helps you greatly because checking GST is now very simple. Once you've made all your adjustments in Prepare GST, you can click on the icon that says Mark as Filed and your GST for this period will be finalised. Once you've clicked on Mark as Filed, you can also click on File Online with IRAS. This will bring you to the IRAS website where you can key in your SingPass and password. You can file your GST by keying in the figures from this report. Another very useful report in the GST tab is the GST Detail Report. This report shows you every transaction for every single box number. For example, box number 6, I see a list of all transactions recorded and I can drill into it which will bring me into the invoice itself. Using QuickBooks Online to track GST has now made your accountant's job very easy. That concludes the GSC tab and I'm now going to move on to the reports tab.